Hey guys, what's up? My name is Shane Shelton, and today we are going to finish. None shall pass! Unicorn Way is off limits. There are ghosts everywhere. You show Private Stilson the letter with Headmaster Ambrose's wax seal. Looks legit. I'll let you pass. Show this to Private Connolly in Unicorn Way. Okay, so. Yeah, we get a lot of these. Remember, each. characters with a yellow exclamation point over their heads will have a quest for you. You should get them all while you can. Oh my, you have entered an area with monsters in it. If you want to safely traverse this dangerous area, stick to the sidewalks, dear. They are safe. Not in America. Hello, young wizard. I am Mr. Lincoln. I apologize for the interruption, but I wanted to bring something in. If you ever have any questions about, simply open your spell book and read over the help pages. They contain loads of valuable information. Nice. Ah, a letter from the headmaster. You're very brave to bring this to me. Be careful going farther down Unicorn Way. The street is dangerous. I've seen wizards like you go down that way and never come back. Beware. Your arrival is a blessing. We need help fending off the ghosts in Unicorn Way. Some dark forces have risen and we don't have enough guards to stop them. We would be honored if you would use your powers and chase lost souls away for us. Remember that you can bring up your map by pressing the M key or clicking on the map icon within your spellbook. Okay, thank you. So basically, all I gotta do now is go take out these ghosts. And what the fuck is this over here? Oh, cool. Okay, so. Ah. So. I played a little bit of this, so I know how exactly how to use my magic and stuff. So I'm level 2. Awesome. This game is really fun, though. I mean, if you're kind of like a kid, this game is really cool. I will have the battles take place. So, let's go ahead and take out three of these. Minor Death Trap. So. Ouch. Forty-five. Now other people can join right in the middle of your game, which is really cool too. I mean, they could just literally walk right on into the battle, which is really cool. <laughs> Fucking <it>, damn. <clears throat> Okay, so that's one out of three. Okay, so there we go. Should have grabbed that over there, which is a health thingy. He's probably gonna kill me now. 95. No, I'll kill him before the thing's out. And I'll grab that health thing with those heal you just a little, yeah. Now see like he can walk over here and join this battle. And I'll show you exactly how that works. But I mean, this game is really cool, like I love games like this. You know, just it's a very unique type of game. Very, very unique. Like, I've never seen another game like this. You may notice small red lights. If you manage to catch one, the blue wisps that you find will restore a bit of your mana when you catch one. So yeah, we're gonna need one of these. Where are these wisps? Where are they at? There's one. So I can actually fight one more of these before it kills me. Fizzle. What the fuck did he do? Fizzle. What the fuck's Fizzle? Now, the same thing goes for monsters. If monsters just happen to walk right in those circles, they'll join the battle too. 
Yeah. What are you doing, my cat? Oh shit! Oh shit! My cat's trying to catch it. <laughs> Way to go, kitty cat. Okay, so we've completed our quest. So let's stay on the sidewalk a little bit. So talk to private crony. We shall do that. But yeah, I'm gonna try to make each one of these episodes at least 10 to 15 minutes. That's why I'm not playing it full swing, because I'm trying to keep an eye on the time. So, minimum settings, by the way, too. That's turn the tide for us. We'll follow your lead and get back to work. If only we knew what's causing the spread of the undead. You should talk to Sarah Nightchant and see if he can use any help. So let's go talk to you. Sure, night. Greetings. Professor Mulinda Wu sent me here to see if the rumors about the fairies are true. The guards won't allow me to go out any further, but they haven't stopped you yet. Would you check for me? Just walk down Unicorn Way and see if you can find any fairies. If they attack, you'd best know how to defend yourself. Defeat the fairies. Okay, you know, I'm getting sick of that of this chat thing. I can use it anyways. I won't be using the chat when I play them. Um, that much. So, hey, look, a healthy. I just happened to walk right in the middle of the battle. So, this is how it works, too. Um, what, will the, what they will do is they'll all attack. And then... I'll get a chance to attack. Yeah, see like what that guy did. So, well, I'll each we'll each get a turn now. Any time. So I'll actually get a chance to attack. So, oh man, we got this fucker in here too. Oh, he didn't attack me. Damn. Oh, I chose to attack that one now. Well, I still get a chance to attack. Nope. So, I don't think I'll get it to attack first. Fizzle. Nah, I think I'll still get the XP for helping them. Some more um, health before I before I fight these fades because I fought one of them last time just for the hell of it and they're pretty strong so let's um, let's go ahead and end the episode here and next time we will take on these fairy guys we will take them on so thank you guys for watching my name is Shane Shelter and this is Wizards 101.